Well, welcome back my gardening friends. A uh, very blustery uh, weekend of the 9th and 10th of March. Now, I've just been doing uh, a wee experiment using my liquid plant foods, comfrey on the left, uh, nettle tea on the right, and realistically, uh, they're both doing uh, uh, quite well. Now, these plants were absolutely riddled with white fly earlier on in the season and for some reason they all disappeared yet it's been quite mild but there was enough damage done to this one uh, so there's no main head and you might think well those aren't very big but if you don't take them now then they will uh, go to flower so I'm going to uh, take a pick in off these and uh, put them into the uh, the trays and uh, see what uh, we get uh, off each plant at the moment it looks like this one uh, has got more on it and this is the comfrey when you're doing this it does look quite uh, quite brutal but uh, there's a few white fly on there but not many but yeah the main uh, top just take out completely and then just take off the uh, individual shoots and you can literally uh, eat uh, all of that. Kettle's boiling, time for a brew. So I've just been picking away. Now this purple sprouting has just gone a little bit too far. You can see, if I show you, that the, uh, the new ones are growing just below. So basically we should be cutting it off there and leaving this bit on the plant so that these three can grow similar to this. Let's see if I can find another example. So basically between each leaf a new one grows so we only take uh, the top part of the uh, broccoli move on to the next one so the main object of uh, picking the uh, purple spray it in is to make sure it doesn't flower because once it starts flowering it stops growing and cutting off as many of these small heads uh, as we can to leave uh, the ones at the back and uh, pick pick and pick regularly now the reason the debris netting's there because uh, the pigeons love to fly and they land on the top so I just cover everything over if they can't land on the top, they can't get at your prize um, uh, florets. some uh, quite big storms coming in so I'm putting some extra staples in to make sure the wind doesn't uh, blow this over and I'll be checking this uh, on a regular basis and picking any fruits that we get so comfrey nettle manure bin runoff but like you say uh, pick regularly and uh, I'll continue to feed uh, I might miss this week and give them another feed next week in order to overdo it and see what we actually get of these plants but that's the first harvest of the purple sprouting broccoli it is in the ground for such a long time and some people when they get to uh, January and February think uh, nothing's happening but be patient it will give you uh, a fruit nature uh, always finds a way of reproducing and it will go to flower once stressed. Happy gardening to you all. Till next time my friends. Ta-ra for now.